Mommy peeked and Santa brought you so many presents. <gasps> Did you hear Santa last night? You hear him on the roof? Blinky. <gasps> you want to get out? Sleepy sacks off so we can go look at the presents downstairs. Yeah. Okay, ready? Let's do three, two, one. Up. Oh. Yeah, we should turn that off. I promise you there's something very special downstairs. Put your CP sack in your bed, please. Good job. Yay! Good job. Do you need help? Good job. Okay. Are we ready to go see what Santa brought? Oh my goodness. What's over there? Do we see presents? Look! Oh my! Whoa. Oh, did you take a bow? What's over there, Benny? and Merry, Merry Christmas. I hope everyone is having an amazing Christmas and Christmas morning. Right now it is about 8.15 in the morning, so still pretty early. I did go ahead and make some breakfast for the boys and they ate that. We have yet to open any of their gifts and that is because we are waiting to FaceTime my mom to open all of the gifts together. Harris is out right now. 
grabbing us some coffee to enjoy while we do that. And then once he gets back, I'm going to FaceTime my mom. And I think my sister, we're gonna add my sister into the call so that the boys can open all of their gifts for Christmas. They did go ahead and take off all the bows. I knew that was going to happen. That was like the first thing they did last night with their Christmas no. jammies. And then the first thing they did this morning was rip off all of the bows no. from the presents. But I am so excited. No. I cannot wait to open all of their gifts. I think I'm going to keep today's vlog pretty simple and quick. I think I'm going to vlog us opening up all the presents. And then once they are open, I will sit with you guys and share with you guys what my family members got the boys for Christmas. All of these gifts here are from my various family members. So I thought I would do like a Christmas morning slash what the boys got for Christmas kind of vlog so that I can end this pretty early and enjoy my Christmas day with the boys edit it and get it up for you guys so i'm very excited i definitely need my coffee i'm patiently waiting for harris to get home and then once he does we can start opening their gifts Okay, we just got done opening up the boys' presents. We also did stockings. They had lollipops in their stockings, as well as some new forks and spoons. But because they had lollipops in their stockings, they, of course, wanted one of them. But Harris and I are gonna quickly try and clean up all of this. There are a few things that we need to like assemble and put together. So I'm going to try and do that. And then I will sit and share with you guys everything. I also forgot to open up one of them. This is one from me to the boys. So I'm going to do that with them quick. I opened up the ones of like what my family got the boys with them on FaceTime. So I need to open that. And then I will sit and share with you guys what the boys got for Christmas. Ooh, new play kit. Felt stars and felt basket. with their gifts for a little bit i tried to put them all over here to share with you guys but there are a lot of them spewed out all over the floor so i'm going to run through what the boys got for christmas from my family if i can't physically hold it up and show it to you guys i will just throw up a picture of it on the screen so you guys can see what i'm talking about jack's over here on one of his gifts but i will link everything down below that i can just in case you see something that you want to pick up for your little ones the boys are going to be too soon so all of this stuff is geared towards like two two and a half even upwards of three years old so let's start with what my mom picked up the boys so every year my mom always gets the boys some books so this year she got three different books for them she got this one here that is babies love christmas and it's a little look a little flap book all of these i believe she got off of amazon for relatively cheap she also got this christmas one for the boys that they absolutely love this is jolly jingle christmas with 10 festive sounds The boys love these kind of books where you can like press a button and it plays a sound. My mom got the one with farm animals a while ago. Oh, let's not fight. We could share. Listen. Choo choo. Choo choo. Do you like this one, Jack?
Here, Mommy, put it right here. Oh! Wow. If you hear some sounds going off now, they're over there with the book. And then she picked up one more book. This one reminds me of my childhood. We used to have this one when we were kids. And this is Today I Feel Silly and Other Moods That Make My Day. And this one basically teaches your kids about different moods that they can have. This book is so fun to read. Okay, and then the big gift that my mom decided to pick up for the boys are these adorable children's Dyson vacuums that actually work. They do have some suction to them. We just have to get C batteries to put in them, but they're like the cutest. Oh, you want it, Benny? The cutest miniature size of like a life like vacuum like this looks like our vacuum just in yellow so they got two of those that's mommy silly yeah. <laughs> okay moving on to what my sister got the boys she got them two gifts the first being this kids fix it toolbox that comes with like working parts that they can play with i already opened this one for them look do you want a screwdriver or your hammer Screwdriver. And then she also picked up a Melissa and Doug cleaning set. I will put a picture up right here of what that looks like. It comes with a broom, a dust can, a mop, a duster, and a stand for all of it to go on that we assembled. And it's back there. That is really cute. She got both of these things off of Amazon. And I actually mentioned this toolkit in my gift guide video. I think this makes an amazing gift. Imaginative play. And it is just adorable, super age appropriate for the boys. Next, we'll move on to what my grandma got the boys, which my mom actually got Harris and I. You can see Harris is back there. He opened his up already. Mine is down the box. Harris and I got the adult version of this, and these are Hum Colgate electric toothbrushes. I shared a more affordable electric toothbrush in my gift guide video. I was looking at getting that for the boys, and then my grandma found these after my mom ordered those for Harris and I, and she wanted to pick these up for the boys. Okay, baby, let's be careful. What's this? And so she wanted to pick these up. These are super cool. These sync to an app on your phone, just like the adult one does. And your kids can listen to music. Whoa, oh, baby. Let's be careful. Hey. Hey. Whoa. And your kids can listen to music. They can open up an app. They can watch themselves brush their teeth. And then it also maps where you brush your kids' teeth. And it tells you where you need to brush longer, harder, and just like more thoroughly. I actually saw this on TikTok a while back and totally forgot about them. So my grandma got a green one and a red one for the boys. And then like I said, my mom got Harris and I the adult versions that I'm really excited to have for us. Harris is back there, this is blue. And I think my mom got me the green one. Next, moving on to what my grandparents in North Carolina got the boys. This is gonna be a little hard to hold up, so I will also insert a picture, but I talked about this in my gift guide video, and this is a wobble board. Jack already has started using his, and he absolutely loves it. These have like a carpeted, he's banging on a box, please excuse that. A carpeted soft bottom to help it rock back and forth on the floor. And so your kid can stand on it like, do you wanna, do you wanna go on it? Come here. Your kid can stand on it like this and wobble back and forth, or you can put it like this and they can climb on top of it like that. She got both of those off Amazon, I believe. I think most of the stuff you can find on Amazon, which is amazing if you see something you like. Easy and fast shipping. And then I'll quickly share what I got them for their stockings and I'll show you guys the big gift that Harrison and I got them. So in their stockings, I picked up some more forks and spoons. I got a huge rainbow set at just our stop and shop. I was gonna order them off of Amazon and completely forgot. And so I found these ones. I don't remember the brand of them. If I can find them, I'll link them down below. But they are just toddler forks and spoons. They came in um, the entire rainbow. The other half, whoa baby. The other half is in the other stocking that I didn't take out yet. We also got them more soap and lotion. We got them their Bomba socks. We were gonna get these for Hanukkah, but we held off and got them for Christmas. These are just um, grippy socks, as you guys can see, so that they can't slip and fall on the hardwood floor. This is their black set. The boys already have their tie-dye set that I think they discontinued, but you can still get this black, gray, and white set. We got two pairs of those, and then we also, I don't wanna take them out of the bag because they will want another one, but we got them Yum Earth Organic Lollipops. The boys are absolutely obsessed with those. And so I got a pack of 50 and put a bunch of them in these stockings, but they've already broken into the other ones that we've had in the cabinet. 
So that is everything we put in their stocking. And then for the large gift that Harris and I got the boys, I'm going to pull it over here in a second and show you guys. We actually got them their newest Love Every Play Kit. Boys are playing on their wobble boards back there, but we got the boys their newest play kit for Christmas. I've mentioned these in many, many videos. I even had them in our gift guide video, and I think Love Every Play Kit to make an amazing gift. It really takes the thought out of gift giving because you buy one play kit and you get five to six physical activities. You get a book, and then you also get a pamphlet in here that gives you more at-home activities that you can do with things laying around your house. But the boys have already broken into this. They've taken two different activities out so far. They took out the chunky wooden jigsaw puzzle and have been playing with this. And they also took out the transfer tweezers, felt stars, and felt basket. They've been playing with that. I have no idea where the pieces even are. Here's one of the stars. They've been playing with these. They can't wait to bust into the other items. So let me run through quickly. This is the companion play kit. That's for months 22, 23, and 24. All of Love Every Play Kits are in three month increments. The boys turned 22 months last month, right? Yeah, last month they turned 22 months. And so that's when I got this in the mail, but I saved it for Christmas for them. So this will be good until they turn two. Like I mentioned, they already opened up two of the activities, these two right here, but it comes with one, two, three, four additional activities. So you get six activities in total in this play kit. You get a book in every single play kit. This one is Graham Turns Two. And then you also get a drawstring bag in this play kit to help with the Montessori animal match. So this is the bag here. Ooh, Bubbies, look. Piggy! Let's see if I can find. Ooh, our mommy's gonna open. What's this, Jackie? What does the cow say? What does the cow say? Moo moo. Benny is taking out the wooden posting stand. This is the little activity you guys can see right here where the child uses fine motor skills, hand-eye coordination to help match the wooden dowels into the correct size of the hole. The activity has all different sized holes here and then the wooden dowels come in all different sizes. Your brother took them, maybe they're over there. This is the pamphlet that I was talking about that comes with other activities for you to do at home. This does explain every single item that comes in the play kit in depth and kind of what it's used for and what its target development is. And then at the end of this, it also shares different activities you can do with everyday items in your home, which I love. I love this because it helps create other activities with items you already have. When you're in a pinch, if they're bored with what they have in the house, you can whip this out and kind of create an activity based on things you already have, like water play. That is super simple. So like I mentioned, that is a wooden posting stand, Montessori animal match. It also comes with the bucket barrel, which Benny took over here. This is great for hands-eye coordination. They learn how to open up a buckle and then clip it back together. Look at this, Jackie. Ooh. Wanna play? And then the last activity this one comes with is the mosaic button board. You guys can see right there which is what this is here. I have no idea what this is for. I'm actually going to look in the pamphlet here. So it says the upright practices with fine motor strength. Hmm. I guess it's just used in an upright position where your child can push the different color buttons into the corresponding quadrants of the tool and learn like matching and fine motor skills. This one is really nice. And then the boys did steal the book. The book went somewhere. I'm not too sure where it went, but this is the companion play kit. Like I said, I have talked about Love Every before. I will link this one down below as well as the other ones that the boys have had and have used. We also have a bunch of standalone toys of the boys from Love Every, like their blocks are here. They absolutely love that. I talked about that in my gift guide. I feel like that would make an amazing gift. That is it. That is everything that the boys got this year for Christmas. Like I mentioned, these are all the gifts that my family picked up for the boys. And we did FaceTime my mom this morning like you guys saw. So they got to see them open this stuff. I do have to send my grandma who got the boys the wobble boards a picture of them on them. I have them flip the other way right now and they were both just climbing on them and they absolutely love that. But I am going to go ahead and end this video here. I wanted it to be a pretty quick 
easy, chill Christmas vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I would love to know what you got your little ones if they're around the boy's age or even a little bit older or younger. I would just love to know what you got your little ones for the holidays this season. So let me know down below. And with that being said, we will see you in our next video. Bye guys.